Hello, welcome to the first real episode of the Spaces Coding Tutorials. If you don't know who I am or what this is, you should probably watch the intro video first. So what is a programming language? A programming language is just like any other language. Just like how you can speak English, German, or Arabic, you can talk to a computer using Java, Python, or Haskell. These are all different ways of giving a computer instructions, and each one has its pros and cons. For example, Python is easy to learn. You can do a lot of things with it too. However, it's slower than most programming languages. We aren't going to need our programs to be super fast though, because our focus is art. So you might be wondering where to start writing code in the first place. Well, we need to install two things, our IDE, the Integrated Development Environment, which is just a fancy way to say the thing we type in, and the Python programming language itself. First, we need to download an IDE. I'm going to show you how to download the one I really like, called Sublime Text. First, look up Sublime Text 3. It should be the first link. I'm using Windows, so I'm going to click on Windows 64-bit. Once it's done, run the executable and go through the install process. You probably won't need to change any of the settings. I'm going to pin it to my taskbar so I can get to it easily. Now go to python.org slash downloads and click the big yellow download button. When it's finished, just run the executable and don't forget to check the add python 3.8 to path option. Then just click install now and let it do its thing. Hopefully when it's done, it will say setup was successful. Now you're prepared to write some Python programs. This video is getting a bit long, but I don't want to leave you empty handed, so let me show you how to make the computer say hello. First, open Sublime Text and go to File, Save As. You can either select Python in the drop down menu, or end your file name with .py. The .py at the end of your file tells the computer that this file is a Python program. Then just click Save. Now just go to the Tools menu, go to Build System, and click Python. Copy exactly what I type onto the screen. If all goes well, when you click Build in the Tools menu, the text Hello should pop up on the bottom left of the screen. I'll explain how this works next time, because this episode is getting quite long. Sorry it took a while to make this video, I'm still getting used to the new school year, but the schedule should get better soon. I'm hoping like, a new video every week or two. See you next time!